in this video i am going to teach you a jab technique that will help you win all of your fights the jab is by far the most important and the most useful punch in the sport of boxing if you watch professional boxing fights and you know a bit about boxing then you will know that larry holmes has one of the best jabs in the history of the boxing so to teach you how to throw the jab perfectly i am going to explain you the technique that was used by larry holmes he says that jab isn't a punch the jab is a slap he explains the mistake that fighters make today is this they punch with the jab that is they keep their fist tight closed while throwing that jab and that's why their jab is slow so instead of punching with the jab slap with the jab what it means by this is your arm needs to be as much of a width as it can be imagine your arm is like a towel you need to just be touching your opponent you don't need any power jab is not meant to be the knockout punch it's the range finder you are finding where your opponent is you are figuring out how close or how far you are to be able to land those big power punches the best thing about this jab technique is these are still scoring shots and don't requires a lot of energy you are just whipping out this punch and trying to study your opponent you are figuring out how close you need to get to be able to land those big bombs there are different variations of the jab the first one is called the stiff jab or the power jab just like this there is a bit more power behind it because we are stepping forward with our front foot while throwing this jab and all of our body weight is behind the punch adding more power to it this one was constantly used by gennady golovkin throughout his boxing career and he found a lot of success with this one The second one is obviously the lightning fast jab like whipping technique used by Larry Holmes. The third one is the jab to the body. Now there is a very common mistake that beginners boxer make while throwing that jab to the body is they keep their head at that center line and they get countered. The right method is when you throw that jab to the body make sure to keep your head off that center line just like this. The fourth one is called the screw shot or the up jab. Sometimes our opponent keeps his chin tucked with the solid high guard and we face difficulty to find his chin and land clean shots. So then we use that up jab to pop up the chin of the opponent so that we can land that big right hand. So these four are different types of the jabs. Practice all these kinds of jabs when you are shadow boxing. The more you can vary up your jab, the more you are going to confuse your opponent. Now there are two important points that I want to discuss. First one is most of the beginner boxers try to reach their opponent while jabbing. They lean forward and mostly they get countered. If you want to reach your opponent then you can use your footwork like take a step forward with your front foot while throwing that jab everything comes off your feet the second one is make sure you are protected while throwing that jab keep your chin tucked behind your left shoulder when you shoot your jab and keep the other hand up to protect the other side of the body just like this so guys these all are the fundamentals of the jab i hope you enjoy my video you can also subscribe my youtube channel if you want to learn boxing and mma in detail at home see you soon in the coming video